confusion as Unamde Kano speaks on how Biafra will happen. Leader of the indigenous people of Biafra has insisted that a sovereign Biafra nation will soon emerge. Kano stated that Biafran agitators should be given a chance to determine if they want to remain a part of Nigeria or form a separate nation. This is as he condemned those assuming the position that the leaders of the people from the region are not in support of the actualization of Biafra. Many Nigerians have wondered how Biafra will criticize or crystallize in Nigeria. However, taken to the microblogging site, Twitter on Sunday, Kano submitted that Biafra will soon become a reality through a referendum, whether those against the agitation like it or not. He noted that the voice of the people is more important than what the leaders of the region want, and his opinion, the people want a referendum, which will give them an independent Biafran nation. His tweet reads, the narratives that leaders of the so-called South-South and South-East, or even those in the National Assembly are against Biafran is irrelevant. What's relevant is the popular will of the people, which can be determined only through referendum, like it or not, it shall happen. Namdekano has spoken. And that's it. See, the voice of the people is what counts and not the voice of the government. Because the government will surely want to defend themselves. Just like I said, that a passenger will not want to support division because of his personal benefit. Because of his personal benefit, do you expect someone who has been in government before to support the breakup of this country? To support the division of this country? Don't you know that if this country is divided, is all of its benefits will completely be cut short? We completely cut short. And that is why you see that our Southeast governors are not supporting. They are not supporting. So they are only after their own personal gain and not you. So that is why when they are saying that you should not mind them, they cannot. It's a lie, you. It is a lie. It is for their own good, though. I am telling you the humble truth. So don't ever listen to them. They are fighting for their own pocket. What they are gaining is what they are gaining, and what they will gain is what they are fighting. Do you understand? See, the best way for us to experience peace in this country is for this country to divide, so that everyone will go its own way. Look, as we are experiencing a, 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 a genocidal attack and killing in the southeast, do you think it's affecting them? Their children, uh, their children are not here in, in Nigeria, and that is why they keep calling for more, for more deployments of soldiers. Their children are not here; they have moved all their children abroad. Do you understand? So, you are the one suffering it. You are the one suffering it. So you must not give in to their tricks. That's why when I look at the people, those some of our, some of our, some of our people who are fighting for these people, I just say, <laughs> you people don't know the people you are fighting for. You don't even know the the, 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 the governments you are fighting for. You are, you are just fighting blindly. Blindly. What Namde Kanu sees, I tell you, you cannot see it. You cannot see it. You are just watching like fools. Why, the, why these criminal governors are using you as political talk to work for them? To work for them. So these things that Nanda Kano is saying is for your good. It's for your good. Don't listen to them. The best thing is division. Let us divide and let everyone go its own way. Let everyone go its own way. They are doing this because they don't want to lose. They don't want to be at the losing end. They don't want to be at the losing side. They know what they stand to lose. Now, Unam the Kanu is now telling you now that, look, 
This is how Biafran is going to happen. This is how Biafran is going to take place. And it's telling you that nobody, no Jupiter, no person is going to stop it from happening. Which is true. Nobody. Nobody is going to stop Biafran from happening. No. Is it possible? Is it possible? If it is possible, they would have stopped it. They would have stopped it, but it is not possible. And that is why they are just handicapped. Look at Buari. The, the language of Buari have changed. You know, previously Buari used to say never that Biafran will ever come to play in his administration. But now his English have changed that even if the Biafran is actualized, they won't be allowed to go. <laughs> so when I heard such a, a news, I was just like, I just laughed. You know, I laughed because I know the, the president is trying to console himself. Because he knows that Biafran freedom is already actualized. It's already actualized now. You understand? So he's just trying to console himself. He's just trying to, you know, put himself together. That's what he's trying to do. You see the gist? So let us stop deceiving ourselves. Let us stop lying to ourselves. We already know what is on ground. Even President Mubarak already know that Biafran is actualized. Look at uh, 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 the, the Northern Coalition. They are now agitating for the Biafrans. Yes, now. They are, they are agitating for the Biafrans. As of today, they said that they can no longer be fooled. That they have seen reason why the Biafrans deserve a freedom. You see? Someone once said something one time ago that a time will come when the eyes of the Northerners will be open and they will go after Puari. And I think that time has come. The Northerners are becoming wise now. They are becoming wise. Yes, they have seen it that Buari is deceiving them. They have seen it that Buari is deceiving them. That Buari is taking them for a fool. He's taking them for a ride. He's cheating on them. He has deceived them. They have been cheated. And that is what is making them to cry aloud. To cry aloud. You see that? So it is painful. Very painful to them. They never believed that bury of all person that they fought for, that they stood for, that they treated Good Luck Jonathan administration oh, to step down. Just because they want Barry to come to power, is now the one against them. It's not the one against them. So what are we going to say about this now? Who are we going to lament or cry to? Hmm? You see all these things, these are the things we are talking about that a lot of persons don't seem to get or understand. Hmm? That is it. So I'm happy that this is happening. I'm happy that this is going on. So that the world will see the shame of this country. So the world will see the shame of this country. Let me hear from you anyway to know what you have to say about this. If you are new, click on the red subscribe buttons as well as the bell button to receive more updates. Thank you.